Howdy y'all, it's Cody from the Keepers Nerd. How you doing? Apparently, this, this is amazing. We have a new little winter contingency pass. And let's see here. Okay, so we have two different options like here. So 500 of whatever the currency is, premium pass, and we get the armor coating ice fissure, which does look good if that's how it looks. I do have already blue though. So, and you have the backs the the battle pass access permanently otherwise there's the 2000 premium so let's not get that su generis weapon charm it's a snowflake that looks good let's look through the uh the battle pass here um okay so ice fissure it looks good it really does ah dang it i don't want to spend my coins on that because then i won't be able to afford the next battle pass well played well played all right let's go through okay that's lame XP boosters, nobody cares. Uh, nameplate, yay, whatever. Another nameplate, lame. Icy veins, weapon coating. All right, all right. Uh, I mean, I like it because it's blue, but it's hard to tell because the blue lighting from the board always. I hate that. Just can't tell. I want to know. XP boost, whatever. Kaleidoscope, okay. Kaleido blades, nameplate. That's kind of fun. Okay, Mark 7 chest plate. Tactical presentation. Interesting. Gift wrapped. It's white and like white gray and red. Okay. All right, XP boost. That's all right. Radical tactics nameplate. There's a lot of nameplates here. Nameplate again. Care package. Good gracious. Tactical knee warmers. Okay, those are fantastic. I love it. Just to have that little snowflake logo, that's fantastic. All right, winter mint green. So camouflage green with red interior stuff like on the under armor. XP boost again. I hate whenever a whole pass tier is just an XP boost, but it is a free pass, you know, that's cool. Pogi packs with the little s snowflake symbols and some wrappings and a candy cane weaponry on the back. That's awesome. All right, I like it. And tactical mittens, awesome, with like bells for the the knuckles <laughs> and the snowflake patterning. And these are nice. Krampus canes, nice with those candy canes on the shoulder pads. Looks good. Man, this is good. And then winter night, uh, that is that is an ugly helmet. <laughs> I like it because it's just derpy, but it's ugly. And frost glaze, ooh. Ooh, that by itself is worth the entire pass right there. Ah, I just, we're going to have to go look at the ice fissure separately inside the, the thing. So it's equipped. So we're good there. Um, yeah, we just, we don't need to upgrade it unless we really want to No, I want to go to the shop and see. Santa's little helper weapon wrap. Oh, we only got like one weapon wrap for a weapon in that whole pass. That's crazy. Legendary weapon model. I don't, I don't understand. Um, okay. Oh, that's fun. These are cool. Oh, okay. That's ridiculous and I love it. Oh my word, that's terrible. Okay. Wow, this is crazy. I like the winter stuff. I I wish Halo Infinite had truly been faster on all this stuff, because man, Christmas lights, those are cool. Ah, that's what's so sad to me. It's like we're getting something really cool. That, I like that, that's fun. Weapon coatings. This is quite the, uh, look at those shoulder pads, that's awesome. Kill effect turned him into a snowman. Not bad. Uh, that is, that is bad. <laughs> what are some of these things? Okay, so holiday cheer. Oh my goodness. It's just some of the wraps. Oh my word. Okay. Hearth fire. There's that frostbite effects, 45% off. I love it. Ugh. 
if it wasn't a thousand, I would totally jump in on that. But because the shoulder pad, shoulder effects are awesome. The kill effect is ridiculously cool. The horns are just whatever. But then the the mythic effect set is amazing. I love it. Ah, that is a thousand. That's not bad. And there's the sleigh bells. Common evolved armor still for way too expensive. Should have been free. Scarlet blend. Yeah. I think overall, uh, the free battle pass is really good. Let's go see if we can see the uh, armor coating really quickly. Mark 7. There we go. Let's just keep there. I know we have wraps for everybody. So that should be purple, right? Um, peppermint laugh. Oh, these are my stuff I've already unlocked. So, whoa. Hello. All right. We'll keep going here. Oh, when did I get that? Huh. Sometimes I start forgetting like what I actually unlocked. Crazy corruptor. Okay. All right. Let's look here. It was. Where is it? Blue Mojo. That. Oh. Oh my. I do like that. Cloud Nine. I know. Ah, those were so cool, especially that one. Anyway. Holy cow. Oh, I do like that. Where is it? Show me the wrap. Weird. Um. Nope, nope, nope. No. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, I do like that silver. It's nice. Huh. Simple. Nope. <laughs> uh, where is it? Was it a legendary coating? Estate gold? No, that's not it. Whoa, Grim Fortress. What is that? That is ridiculous. Liberty clad? Nope. Night Witch? No. Pattern shift? Can we not view it? Ah, what was it? I hate when they do that. Because I can't see it. Ice fissure and it's purple. Yeah, we did not see that at all. Um... Why can't we inspect it? Anyway. Yeah, I think Ice Fisher is really pretty. I just wish we could actually like get a closer up on it because I think I can see the, the pattern of snowflakes and stuff, but it's just hard to tell and we can't look at it apparently in the regular just armor effects the area. So let me know down in the comments below. What do you think of this battle pass, this little free winter contingency thing, unless you want to pay 500 and get ice fissure which is cool but i mean when i've already got that it's not that i need it but it would look really neat so yeah uh like share and subscribe let me know down in the comments below what are you most excited about with this battle pass i i think it's gonna be fun and i love all the the festive stuff because it'll look pretty stinking awesome might do some redesigns on my armors now. I've been Cody from the Keepers of Nerdum. Again, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for joining us already. Take care. Bye.